We are reading from the Nectar Ocean of Sri Radha's flavors. From Shri Sri Radha Rasa Sudhanidhi from Sri Padra Padananda Sarasvati, in verse 28. The same mind. Kiki, take shelter of sweet natured Radha, who is like a grove full of rich living wines. Who reveals a wonderful abundance of powerful Rasika compassion and who is a deep and unbridled nectar ocean of love. We are going further with a quotation from Jiva Goswami. Exclusive surrender reaches perfection in two ways. First, knowing no other shelter than the lotus feet of the Lord that grant fearlessness and immortality. Second way of surrender is, although the devotee had taken shelter of someone else due to not being so wise yet. He gives up that shelter and takes exclusive shelter of the same Supreme Lord anyway. Maybe we have to clear who is praying this, to whom. Uh, what is it the first? This was the real question also. Who is praying this? When you start this verse, hmm? or saintly mind? Who is praying? Who is praying? Who is praying? In front. The next yeah. sentence is more intense. Read you utterly. Full. Person. Yeah. Person. Yeah. Ah, then you leave this world. <coughs> then subject not clear. Means demoniac mind cannot do this. And saintly mind will do this. If you don't say this word, it's a subject is not clear. There are two types of mind. One is demonia and one is Yes, it is a question of surrender. Surrender? Demonia will not surrender. <laughs> Demoniac mind means who is living in the false ego, who is controlled by senses and false ego, they are demoniac. Demons, <coughs> dark energy, black energy. Identified with the body. They are living in ego. They are demoniac. In the human body they are demons. More dangerous than this ghost. They can do more bad things. They are demoniacs. Ghost has no body, the human body also there, and mind is ghost mind. More dangerous. They can break the face. Or they can do many theater unknowingly. They think that this is the, my job, but they destroy whole. Yeah. Basic thing is this, 
where he spent that destroyed that. These are demons. We have to fix this part because we have experience of this, even in our Sangha. Right? If you break the face, what will left? Face is the basic. It's Guru's teaching from the beginning on. He always preached about faith, hope, and love. And if you have no faith, then the next steps never will happen. Who are not bad? Hopeless. Hopeless. And you see, if we have examples. Out of hope is hopeless. <coughs> Hopeless. Their life is hopeless. Means there is no hope in life is hopeless. And love will never come. Never. Hopeless. And demons break the faith. Hypocrites said, why I say human body also demon? When the false ego is there, they are more demoniac because they break the faith. And the faith is the basic thing to grow my life. There's another way, but the maid servants of Sri Radharani. But again, you will. First word, first word, repeat again and again. Gently mind, gently mind, gently mind. Quickly, take shelter. Always repeat this. The same mind. Yes. The same mind. If I have, when it will become centrally mind? Mind means mind, false ego, isn't it? And this is Kaliya. Why Mahap, um, Krishna is went to Jamna to jump? You know this Kaliya Lila? Give me my two energy I have to use. You are holding a mic in your hand. No, it's not. Is this longer? This is longer. This is longer. Which one is longer? Which one is longer? This one. This chair has to be uplifted. Rather. No, no, you don't have to be uplifted. <laughs> Take more mic. <coughs> there are two mic you need. Yes, we have. It's not working good. So now it's good. Uh, so what is the meaning of centrally mind? There is no kandya, poison is there. Krishna knowingly playing in the jhana near to the Jamna with his friend. And one of the friends, he makes one ball. And he is mad for that ball. And Krishna knows that in this Jamna, one Kaliya snake is very poisonous living there. So he, all the Brajavasis, not alive to go there, but that day Krishna in playing and playing, he threw this ball in Yama. Knowingly. Why? Because he want to go there. 
to protect his friends, Pradivasis, everyone from this study. And he is so poisonous. So even the water becomes poisonous. You see, sometimes Jamuna becomes very heavy. They say very poisonous water is coming. And this. So this is Kali. <laughs> Many times Kadya is reminding that still I am there. And then Krishna did start telling, it was so loving God to me, why it goes to the Jamna? And you throw that. Krishna said, I give you other boy. Better than this boy, and this uh, his friend Sridam, who is very little naughty and very wasty, he said, "No, I like that ball. I am not satisfied with your other ball." Krishna jumped in the this. Now they every Prajvasi know and they are crying out because this water is poor because of the Kahya. And when they Krishna went, then Kaliya wants to cover him and want to poison and kill him. But he said, Krishna, he want to hold him with the hand, Krishna. We come here from child to big, and then blood starts coming from the snake. The poison is nothing problem for him. And he want to kill. Then his wife come and start praying. This is you make this poison and this snake, and he is my heart. So you have to give the place to you. Why you want to give? You see, Kaliya. Stop. You know? Kalya has a poison, what he will give? Not kill my husband. You say he has only poison. If if you take out the poison, then he will not do that. Then Krishna, he breaths to his wife that I will not kill. And, and he starts dancing on the head of God. Why? To take out the poison. What is our poison? All ego is our poison. You are not listening to me. Sorry. You are thinking something else. This is our false ego that my poison and poison is my false. They block us and he is sitting in my mind. That mind not become clear to understand the <laughs> This is Kadya. And when Krishna danced on the head of the false ego, 
stand for ego poison good so my head if krishna is not dancing for ego will never go means always you have to rem- remember krishna to remove your faults if not then false ego will take that place and dance on my through me and if the krishna is in my chanting and meditation then false ego cannot come this way my mind becomes and this is sentiment when there is no false ego and false ego only goes when krishna is there then you will say here is the only radha and krishna is how krishna come are bina krishna radha is only thinking of krishna they are not two subjects one is krishna and his alladini shakti is radhika his energy is radhika is not true when two soul come in one body is chaitanya radha and krishna in one body is chaitanya and when two soul take separate body is radha and krishna i oh yeah The two soul in one body is Chaitanya, and when they become two souls, separate body is Radha and Krishna. So they are one. One is there, other is also there. When the sensory mind will come, then love will start. Love is not coming. without krishna you see prabhu pad bhagavad gita tan when you sign with krishna what is meaning of signing nobody knows you are how many years in this form tell me sir that year say about this they give the bhagavad gita tan tan explain this no i have to understand no difference with krishna and radha is not human body like me and you you the divine also swam tamada is explaining this yes it's listen give the mic to him ah <coughs> Should you read the whole book or only that paragraph what they want to read i want to know from him the meaning to <laughs> those to those who are constantly devoted to serving me with love i give the understanding by which they can come to me loud lecture to those who are constantly devoted to serving me with love i give the understanding by which they can come to me proper in this verse the word bhakti yoga is very significant we may remember that in the second chapter the lord instructing arjuna said that he had spoken to him of many things and that he would instruct him in the way of buddhi yoga now buddhi yoga is explained buddhi yoga itself is action in krishna consciousness that is the highest intelligence buddhi means intelligence 
and yoga means mystic activities or mystic elevation. Mystic! Material not divine activities. So, material activity is not divine activity. Mystic. Go on. When one tries to go back home, back yes, home. who try to go back home, they are interested in mystic divine activity. Who want to stay in the material world, why they will try here? No need to try. They don't do all the material activities. Mystic means divine. Beyond the material thing, that's a mystic. Or not. Say me, my English is not good, it's very bad. Yeah. Listen, it is important to understand the things. Not this will understand, we will come without this. Blocking the thing. Go on. When one tries to go back home, back to Godhead, and takes fully to Krishna consciousness in devotional service, his action is called Buddhi Yoga. In other words, Buddhi Yoga is the process by which one gets out of the entanglement of this material world. The ultimate goal of progress is Krishna. People do not know this, therefore the association of devotees and a bona fide spiritual master are uh, bona fide. Association of devotees Sankali Iman. Sankali Iman. Go on. <coughs> One should, one should know that the goal is Krishna, and when the goal is assigned, uh, well, well. then the path uh, is... No, 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 no. <laughs> Assignment means then. I want to buy one house, and I sign contract with the broker, and I want to set another house, maybe other God is better than this. When you are signed a contract, you see other house also. Huh? It's done. Right or not? This is not done. When it's not done, it's not assignment is there. Very important point I say. When the contract is signed, you sign it. I think nobody said this line. You sign it. It's <laughs> still going on about Krishna that you don't doubt it. What Prabhupada right? Now you read. One should note that the goal is Krishna, and and when the goal is assigned. Then the path is slowly but progressively traversed and the ultimate goal is achieved. Yes, now you say, 
goal is higher than ultimate goal. Ultimate goal is higher. He is two words. Go is Krishna. Krishna is a go. And then the ultimate goal is achieved. It's a go of the words. Shrikad is asking, what is a go or ultimate goal? Understand or not? Not understand. Then you understand when Krishna will dance on the false ego, then Krishna is managing your gently man. She is not listening to me. I, why I talk about Sunya? Are you suddenly mind will not come when you not talk about Krishna and he will not dance here? Is a signing is important. Understand? Then suddenly mind will come to see Radhika. So I have to answer this to her. <clears throat> she is German, na? She is doubtful talking about Radha. Why is a Krishna? Other suddenly mind will not come. False ego will be there. To keep the saintly mind, Krishna has to dance. Krishna has to dance. That he not give chance to enter false ego. By looking to Krishna, false ego will not enter to wherever it is. You have to sign Krishna. Then slowly and progressively, slowly and progressively, what will happen? He <coughs> when a person knows the goal of life. But is addicted to the fruits of activities. No, no. That's line only I want to know. When goal is signed, one should know that the goal is Krishna. And when the goal is assigned, then the path is slowly but progressively traversed and the ultimate goal is achieved. Yes, that's it. <laughs> Now Prabhupada said, I not give my words. Last page of Bhagavad Gita. <laughs> last page, last. <coughs> the last. Last verse of Bhagavad Gita. Last paragraph. <laughs> The living entity in its original position is... Living entity, my soul, a... Understand? Prabhupada is right. Living entity, what I we talk, a... I say faith in this, because Prabhupada is standing last of my world. Go on. The living entity in his original position is pure spirit. He is just like an atomic particle of the Supreme Spirit. You see? Hey, I say you, now your father is telling you about marriage. Yes, Supreme Spirit, you see? Why I say if you want? This is one to understand, and faith in this, not in others. Faith in this only. If you are lucky, you will not doubt this. 
This is Prabhupada's word. Last page. Last paragraph. Read that. Again read this. The living entity in its original position is pure spirit. Ah, yes, he did. I talk A. Number one. This is the basic thing to know. If I will forget, I am Kapoor. I am in false ego. I clutch by false ego. Pure spirit, I am not living. Go on. He is just like an atomic particle of the Supreme Spirit. Wow. Understand? Go on. Thus, Lord Krishna may be compared to the sun and the living entities to sunshine. You see? Ray of the sun. Because the living entities are the marginal energy of Krishna. Yes, exactly. Huh? Marginal? No condition. Somebody is very condition. And other book was condition. Go on. You read. I don't know from where you did. No, I did the same thing. Huh? I did the same same sentence. But later on independence also good day. Ah. No. It's condition also with my sense of body possible. Yes. This living entity is covered with my material. Yeah. Huh? Mm. Condition. My senses are there, my plastic body covered, my false ego is covered, is all conditioned, my living entity will die. Yeah, go on. Because the living entities are the marginal energy of Krishna. Marginal, same form. Ping pong ball, you see that? Ping pong. <laughs> I want to be devotee. Are little fun is also Hari Deva important. <laughs> right? <laughs> Again, devotee. Again, after one hour, Hare little fun. Sense enjoyment is also important. Ping pong, ping pong. Is a margin. Means they say soul and swimming in the water. Sometimes swimming, sometimes soul. Is a margin. Right? Agree? No fix. No Asai Bhav, no fixed nation. <laughs> because the living entities are the marginal energy of Krishna, they have a tendency to be in contact either with the material energy or with the spiritual energy. In other words, the living entity is situated between the two energies of the Lord. And because he belongs to the superior energy of the Lord, he has a particle of independence. Ah, more beautiful thing. I will surrender to something, to the soul. No, no, I am very independent. I am independent and see, I will take decision. I am from Germany, you know. I will calculate first, then I will take decision. <laughs> I am very independent. Right? 
Yes. <laughs> I'm Russian. I'm strong. <laughs> strong. <laughs> fighting mood. Colombian will say, I'm a photo. We are mafia. So these are the independence. Right? <laughs> this is profile so much. Go on. By proper use of that independence, he comes under the direct order of Krishna. One chance is that if he is independent, he uses right way. Incidentally, what Suniti is telling? Suddenly in mind. Thus he attains his normal condition in the pleasure giving potency. Yeah. Again. By proper use of that independence, he ah. comes under the direct order of Krishna. Ah. Thus, he attains his normal condition in the normal pleasure given Normal condition. Means I was abnormal, but yes, before we are abnormal. <coughs> All was vain. If I am not become normal, understand? Prabhupada's last line. What is the last line? Thus he attains his normal condition in the pleasure giving potency. What is a pleasure giving potency? Huh? Yeah, and she is bringing there with your normal condition when the mind becomes sensitive. Understand? Now it's clear? This is vision. And this is the word of Prabhupada. If you not take shelter of pleasure giving potency, you are I am not ping pong, ping pong, ping pong, conditional never finish. Outside what I change, inside never change. Believe me. Last word of Bhagavad Gita to take shelter of Radhika to become normal. This is Radha Nistha. This is the reason of Prabhupada of appearance, this he made the parampara. He made the parampara, page four, open. Introduction. <coughs> Not Last paragraph, after five relations. He read, your son read. Yeah. 
You read up to five relations, right? After five relations. After five relations, read. Arjuna was in a different. So Arjuna was in a relationship with the Lord as friend. Of course, there is a gulf of difference between this friendship and the friendship found in the material world. You see, is a spiritual relation, divine relation. Intimacy makes it divine. Intimate. He was intimate and it becomes divine to me. Go on. This is transcendental friendship. This is transcendental. Mystic means transcendental. Beyond material. Go on. Which cannot be had by everyone. Everyone cannot do that. Cannot see even. Go on. Of course, everyone has a particular relationship with the Lord, and that relationship is evoked by the perfection of devotional service. Why I do devote? What is my inner feeling? An inner relation with Krishna, like a friend, like I am working like a child, like he is my baby. Krishna is my child. What inside my feelings? Relation. But in the present status of our life, not only have we forgotten the Supreme Lord, uh, all that, that is the Supreme of God, I make my goal guru. Okay? Prabhupada said the goal is Krishna and I make goal of good. Wow. Wow. Yeah, Prabhupada. Yeah, Prabhupada. Because Guru is my goal. Krishna is not my goal. Then I become kaput. Again, I understand it the German word and words hopeless. Is the way is the navigator. He gave me. This is the navigator. Guru cannot be a goal. Navigator is your goal. No, say that is my goal. He is my life and heart and I will live here. Are they the navigator? I can be goal. He will keep compass to reach to the goal. Not leave him, catch him strongly and go with this. But he is not a good. Understand? Where we do the mistake, Prabhupada, Krishna is your goal. I say Guru is my goal. We have two ways, not his parampara. <laughs> right or wrong? Understand? <laughs> Here we can become kaput. Right or not? Say me. Sure. Jananda Maharaj. Yes, sure. And who see that, so that they are demoniac mind, not saintly mind. Mm. 
understand? I want to explain, you are not look, listening to me that. These are demoniac minds. Association of demons. I, my mind will never become saintly. Be careful. Prabhupada say, A, I do B. <coughs> you follow the Prabhupada parampara. What is parampara? Means lineage. We are Indian. Lineage means you follow father, father follow grandfather. This is parampara. Right or not? Indians know parampara. Right or not? What is parampara? Prabhupada can say that what Krishna created the parampara. Prem parampara. Bhakti parampara. Conscious parampara. Go on. But in the present status of our life, not only have we forgotten the Supreme Lord, but we have forgotten our eternal relationship with the Lord. Ah, I make Guru is my God. Guru is my relation. Guru is my everything. It's nice gone. Because I believe only in the senses, I can see. I don't believe in the soul, I cannot see. I, I, I don't believe in the eternal body, senses, eternal. This is the difference. I'd like to see. I, I see with my material eyes this body. So I believe in this body. I don't believe in the soul. That's the problem. And I don't want to become a spiritual. No, I don't like. I cannot see. I cannot. But I see Guru, but they material. Say this is the demoniac mind. Demoniac parampara. This is demoniac parampara. This is not Prabhupada parampara. <laughs> And they they are following this parampara, they are also demons. They cannot catch the saintly mind. It's a, Kaliya is dancing on the head. You see how the divided happen? Prabhupada is telling something, we do something else. Go on. Understand what I want to say? This is the line. You see, never leave Krishna. Never leave Radha's Krishna. This is something. Radha's Krishna. No other business. Respect to all. I have to fix Krishna to control demoniac And why I put Krishna there? Because Radha's Krishna. Sentry mind will see this. And demoniac mind will say, I am the goal of my life and your life. I will give you everything. He is in the jail himself and he will open your binded hand. He is also in jail and he is going to remove my chains. Wow. Yeah. New prampara ki jai. Demoniac parampara ki Go on. 
Sorry to say. Because of my Suniti and Sudevya, I do explain these things. Go on. Every living being, out of the many, many billions and trillions of living beings, has a particular relationship with the Lord eternally. That is called Suru. By the process of devotional service, one can revive that Suru. And that stage is called Surut Siddhi. They see the God and they deviate in other words. Understand? This is the one. I want to say difference between the saintly mind and the one yet. Understand, my dear friend? You understand, my dear, dear child, babies, my friend. So, what to? Now you have a faith in one number one or not? You say, I have, I have no faith in anything. You have faith in anything. And what to do? Pra by the Prabhupada word? Read again. <coughs> by the process of devotional service. By process of devotion. Divine. Not cheating purpose. <laughs> Not lying for anything. Divinity. Not for missionaries. For yourself. Go on. By the process of devotional service, one can revive that truth. That revive that truth. What you are. By your bhajan, by your divine. Again, read this paragraph. Yes. Arjuna was in a relationship with the Lord as a. Please listen. Arjuna was in a relationship. Ah, go on, loud little. Arjuna was in a relationship with the Lord as a friend. Of course, there is a gulf of difference between this friendship and the friendship found in the material world. This is transcendental friendship, which cannot be had by everyone. Of course, everyone has a particular relationship with the Lord, and that relationship is evoked by the perfection of devotional service. But in the present status of our life, not only have we forgotten the Supreme Lord, but we have forgotten our eternal relationship with the Lord. Our Lord. Every living being, out of the many, many billions and trillions of living beings, has a particular relationship with the Lord eternally. That is called Svaru. By the process of devotional service, one can revive that Svaru. And that stage is called Svaru Siddhi, perfection of one's constitutional position. So Arjuna was a devotee. And that's that perfection of your consciousness position. Understand? Understand? And who teach is only this. Never get there. He is not my goal. Teacher is men talking to you. He is the teacher to clear this is parampara. Out of this is a demoniac parampara. Understand? So Krishna has to dance on the head of Krishna. 
My Radha Rani is not dancing there. <laughs> when demoniac qualities go out, then he becomes mind sensitive. Understand? Last line of the Bhagavad Gita, if you want to abnormal, to natural, then Radharani will help. You want to be abnormal, suffering, then Radharani will not come to you. Without Santili mind, she will not see you. You will not see her because your demoniac influence is there. Your mind will not suddenly she will not come out from the kunja. Krishna will never remove the curtain for Radhika to see my dear. He is, he is the Krishna's priya. And Radhika is the Krishna, is the life for him. Radha's Krishna. Radha's. <coughs> she cannot leave the moment without And she is Krishna consciousness. Prabhupada is telling about that. Krishna consciousness with Radha. Krishna consciousness, if anyone in the world, in verse, is only Radha. We demoniac? Can we a Krishna consciousness? Impossible. Our mind is not suddenly without seeing Radhika, Krishna consciousness will not come. Only she gives Krishna consciousness. She gives Krishna consciousness. I say you from my heart. Without her mercy, Krishna is not conscious to my heart. She is 24-7 living in the consciousness of Krishna only. And Prabhupada is this meaning and give to us one person will become Krishna. <coughs> Santili mind, whose mind is become Santili. My dear friends, you are Santili. We are our Santili. But demoniac is Kariya. When, why to bother this go in the way of Prabhupada? Why advise? Why to change the words of Prabhupada? Why not take this parampara of Prabhupada? Why not follow this line? What by what? Understand. I don't say any wrong thing advice to you. Prabhupada word to understand and follow that. Clear? Today I understood Krishna consciousness. Thank you. <laughs> now I know. Right? Yes. Krishna consciousness. Who is Krishna what is, consciousness? Now? What is this meaning? What is your explanation? No, clear. Without love consciousness. Krishna consciousness. Meaning is love. No one is 
Krishna conscious than Radhi. No one is 24 7. No one. No. He has nothing than Krishna consciousness. This is my song. Go on. And now, certainly, by see her. How you can be Krishna conscious? How she is Krishna conscious? This is Prabhupada Parampara, I say. Not deviation that Guru is the goal and follow the Guru and leave the Krishna and the way of Krishna. Come out from divinity and start doing your project and earn money and this and that. <coughs> and line for the project, for the temple and this and that. Wasting your time, man. Do the right way and right way. You have to beg, but begging is better than deviating from the goal of Prabhupada's words. Yeah, really sorry to say. I will do the mistake for my benefit, but the, the Creator will never excuse me. Savior will never help me. And because I am going out of parampara, please try to understand, my dear brother, Everyone to understand. Now your mind becomes saintly or not? Mind becomes peaceful or not? Say me. This is the divine path, divine way of love. Light by God of now I like Krishna consciousness. <laughs> now I like Krishna word. <laughs> Before I had always these doubts. So many Krishna consciousness, Krishna consciousness, Krishna consciousness. He, he penetrates this thousands of times in, the, in these books. But now good if you make the point that what is the Krishna consciousness? It's Radhika. And it's love. Love is the Krishna consciousness. Right? So now it's, it's so clear. Now I am peaceful. <laughs> Thank you. Man. Because, because, you know, <laughs> Radharani is very confidential. <laughs> so, very sweetly explain Gora Sindhana, my dear. And I also feeling why Pagupa did not say Radha? Because Radha is very, very confidential. Even in, 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 in the Bhagatam, Shukadeva did not mention directly. So, Prabhupada mentioned Krishna consciousness, consciousness. So, only someone who know this Swarupa and Swarupa city follow real parampara, that person could understand the meaning of Krishna consciousness. That I felt by your, by your and uh, Guru David Association. Are Bhaiya, without sending me my daughter, without sending me my daughter, I also don't know, honestly. But this book made me mad to read the Prabhupada again. Read Chaitanya Chaitanya and to 
understand? Wow. Then the book is making you mad. This book and we have to so much in here for the Kavit. And now I want to read Sri Bhagavati. I want to listen. I, when I listen this time, in Vrindavan, only Krishna order, Krishna order, <laughs> to Yoga Maya cover all Vrindavan. <laughs> That Mahamaya cannot interfere. So, who want to be in the Yoga Maya? She protect them. Because one day I am calling to Brajvati, and I thought, Arivaya, you disturb someone. And you're not disturbed. He said, I, when I see Bhajananandi, I never disturb. And when I see the Baniya, there one body is a tourist, then I want to take money to make the money pure from them. <coughs> Brajivachis had a calculation, reason to see who is devotee or not. So, Yoga Maya. Cooperation to the Bhakta is only in Vrindavan, only in Vrindavan. Bhakta Bhagavad, then can you listen? My God. I said, repeat this word. Two, three times, Maya. Wow. This is Maya. Right. Because this is the place of her song. Prema Bhuti, Radha Radha. I'll say it in mind. Take shoot of sweet things of Hara. It was like a grove full of Vishnu Himalayas, who reveals a wonderful abundance of powerful Vasak and compassion. Loudly, Who reveals a wonderful abundance of powerful Vasak and compassion, and who is a deep and unbridled nectar ocean of love. I say to Jai Gurudev, today you really show us how to put the foundation in our hearts. Without the right foundation, and the right understanding and feelings of differentiation, what is the mind and what is saintly and what is not saintly. We catch to Srimati Radhika without the right feelings and then also we become proud again. We think, I know better, it's not Krishna, it's Radha. And then we are not out of our demonic mind even. We are again in the old habits of feeling better feeling I know something, and we have not the right uh, softness in our hearts in this mood of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu Trinata And you now, today, you lay this foundation so we can really enter 
into the sweet natured love and service and feel we want the sweetness of Srimati Radhika with the mercy of Krishna. Lita, again. <coughs> oh, saintly mind. Quickly. Quickly. Take shelter of sweet nature, Radha, who is like a grove full of wish yielding wines, who reveals, she reveals a wonderful abundance of powerful, rustica compassion and who is a deep and unbridled nectar ocean of love. This is Radha. No. No. It was very intense, intense, purifying, and state. Never you go that I was proud of Radha. Never. In the mercy of Krishna that you know. Because you sign with Krishna. You believe full confirm it. Because you know your soul is free. A number one. Number two, Savior. And when you assign Savior, then love door open for you. <laughs> and then when you love door open for you, then you come to love, to see that from the vision of love. Prema Pariyogan is our path. Sambandha, Avideha, soul, and Pariyogan. Please ask. Because otherwise, we really cannot stop. <laughs> so, this is interesting. <laughs> I can add it. Uh, can I add it? <laughs> <clears throat> so Guru Dev is saying, at first we have to know how we are so. Then Guru Dev says, second we have to know Savior. Savior. And then say, assign. Then the love door, the door of love, open. So, and then also Guru Dev mentioned Sambanda. Abhideya, Prayojana. So Sambanda is, we know soul, we know the Savior, we know the relationship, intimate relationship. This is Sambanda. Then we assign, we surrender to Krishna. And then the door of love open. That is devo devotion. This is, this is uh, Abhideya. Our service is love, divine love, starts floating. And then, slowly, slowly, we attain Prema Prayodhana. That is uh, Guru Dev's uh, saying, this class. That's uh, my humble understanding. <laughs> How oh, I understand you. Understand. 
I'm talking about only his love one. How does he feel it's bad? It's painful when we don't 